Hello. So this list is 10 ways to boost your self-esteem. In a nutshell, self-esteem is your opinion of yourself and your abilities. It can be high, low, or somewhere in between. While everyone occasionally has doubts about themselves, low self-esteem can leave you feeling insecure and unmotivated. You might be able to identify a few things that are affecting your opinion of yourself. Maybe you're being bullied or you might feel lonely, or it could be a mystery. Either way, there are heaps of things you can do to help your self-esteem. One is compliment yourself. Um, the love you send into the world has to come from somewhere, right? It comes from within you, and you've got to practice the self-love you deserve. This is especially important when you're giving your love to others. One great way to give yourself love is through a practice called mirror work. Taught in depth by Lewis Hay, walk right up to the mirror um, and compliment yourself. It's as simple as that. It could be anything from your hair looks great today or to I love your authentic, beautiful, unique person that you are. Two, stop comparing yourself to others. Your self-esteem is your own unique piece of the universe. Our world is one big jigsaw puzzle full of pieces that fit together in many ways, but you are one piece and must play your unique part. When you compare yourself to others, you are undervaluing who you truly are. Realize your true self-worth. It may even help you improve your net worth. Three, smile more often every day. Smiling is essential to happiness and improves self-esteem. Studies show that smiling more, even if forced, can generally decrease stress and also has many other benefits. Not only will your mood rise, but you also do the same for others. Remember, as we empower ourselves and smile more, we shine a light for others to follow. They also give themselves permission to smile more, even if for no other reason than the fact that you are still here to smile. Um, four, be gentle to yourself. Be gentle with yourself. You can't change who you are right now. You can only change your pers your perspective on it and shift yourself into a different and hopefully more positive place in the future. Um, also remember to be kind to others. What you say to others, you simply say to yourself. Excuse me. Go into every situation with a mission of improving others' day through kindness and compassion, and you'll see that the energy is returned. Five, focus on how far you've come, not how far you have to go. I do this one a lot. Um, I've come a long ways from where I used to be. Um, so focusing on that has actually helped. Six, reach out and get support. Having positive relationships with open channels of communication is healthy and needed for positive progress. A strong network, whether it be your local community, friends, family, online, will hold you accountable to your own health and well-being. Seven, look for special things that make your day. Um, acknowledge the things that make your day, whether that's thanking someone, ver thanking someone verbally, um, allow gratitude. Eight, eat healthy, organic, whole foods. I don't really eat organic. I'm trying to eat healthier. Hasn't really been working that well, but that's one way. So, you know, um, stay active every day, much like the way of laws of inertia work. Activity is required if you want to stay on top of your game. Physical, mental, and even spiritual activity all count. For flowing water is filled with vibrancy and life, while stagnant water is the opposite. You can choose exercise, do yoga, use apps for self-development, meditate, or you can just read a few chapters of your favorite book to stay active. Um, and then finally, 10, do what makes you happy and follow your passion. So anyway, that's it for today. Thank you.